Hi guys, welcome to our channel. I'm Charlotte and this is Paisley. <laughs> <laughs> if you're new here then thank you so much for watching this video. Um, our channel is primarily focused on Disney and our trips to Walt Disney World and Disneyland as well. But I thought I would try some weekly vlogging in between trips. Um, if you are... <laughs> <laughs> if you are a subscriber already then thank you and welcome back I have I tickle you I have done one weekly vlog in the past um, and that was fun so yeah I thought we'd try it again and show you guys what we get up to and it's good practice in between Disney trips as well so I hope you enjoy so where are we going today? to Disneyland no we're not going to Disneyland <laughs> Mummy and Paisley to dance. Mummy and Paisley are going dancing. It's a ballet day! Show us your moves! No, not that move. <laughs> no. Woohoo! Woo! Ballerina! <laughs> so we've just got done with ballet. It was a lot of fun because it's Mother's Day tomorrow. They had like a. Um, a mum's ultimate boogie, I think they called it. So all the mums went in for the last 15 minutes and did some dancing. With and the... some daddies. And some daddies, that's right. And we did some dancing with the girls and boys, didn't we? Yeah? Yeah. Did you like it? It's Mother's Day tomorrow, isn't it, baby? It is Mother's Day. Oh, you got me a card! I think I did it. <gasps> Oh my goodness! Hi. Yeah, so ballet was a lot of fun, and we're back in our town now. We'll just come to Sainsbury's to do the weekly shop. Don't know if any of you guys have noticed, but I've got this jumper on by Oh My Disney, and it's all of the princes, and I love it. Harvey bought it for me yesterday because it was our two year wedding anniversary, so don't know where that time's gone, but yeah, this was a, a nice present, along with some other bits from Shop Disney, which I shall no doubt show you guys a bit later. What's on your shopping list, Paisley? I don't know. Pick three things you'd like on your shopping list. I need a new microwave to burn up my pizza. Okay. What else? And, um, and mummy needs batteries. Right, mummy can get batteries. Anything else? And the Play-Doh set, ice cream set. Play-Doh ice cream set. Well, none of that sounds like groceries, my baby. Just got home from shopping. I set myself a spending limit this week and didn't quite manage to stick to it. Do you find that always happens? So you go with all the best intentions to the supermarket. It's kind of the unhealthy side over here. Yeah, you go with all the best intentions but then just get carried away. Especially when these bad boys are everywhere. Because who can resist a cabbage cream egg? Oh. Not, and I did manage to also get some bits for Mother's Day, um, which I think I said before is tomorrow. It's Saturday at the moment. I got my mum this little frame ornament, and I think I'm going to put a picture of Paisley in, a picture of my nan and granddad, and a picture of uh, me, my mum, and Paisley at Disneyland because we just got back and got her these daffodils and a lovely llama card, which Paisley helped me choose. <laughs> got some daffodils for ourselves as well aren't they just the happiest flower like you see them start popping up at the sides of roads and things and you think oh it's springtime they're like the definition of springtime so nice how do you get like the yogurt and my mummy's sweets i did boo you okay? Yeah. Hi, Bryn. Hello, boy. So the reason Paisley said earlier that she needed a new microwave is because we bought her this little microwave um, the other day. She's wanted one for ages, but it's such a an ugly toy I didn't want to buy one but she finally she got one I was I had been looking for a nicer looking one uh, just like a grey one or, or something but yeah we couldn't find it so she ended up with the red one. Oh, thank you baby can I have that grape yeah she wanted a new microwave because it came with a little slice of plastic pizza in it and Bren stole it and chewed it up yeah, that didn't last long. Speaking of which, 
photos. Life with a beagle. You just heard him. And Harvey's home. We're off to Cine World to watch Dumbo. We've been looking forward to this film since they announced it ages and ages ago. So yeah, I've heard good things as well, so hopefully it'll be good. Harvey asked me to get him some plasters and I've got him some of Paisley's ones. Anna and Elsa, so he can wear them. I think he's going to enjoy it. <laughs> What part did you like? They live into other um, elephants. When they delivered him to the other elephants. That's beautiful, Paisley. It was really good, wasn't it, Harvey? Yeah, it was. It was really quite nice, actually. There were some sad bits, but it was nice. It's a nice story. It wasn't just a uh, remake. It was more like after what happens in the original film, like what, what goes on to happen next. So yeah, that was really good. We're just going over to Harvey's brother's house for the evening for some dinner and so Paisley can play with her cousins as well. So that'll be fun, won't it darling? Yeah. And we shall see you tomorrow. Morning guys, it's Sunday and it's Mother's Day as well. So I thought I would jump on and show you what Paisley got me. So she chose this nice, happy Mother's Day to mummy from your daughter Peppa Pig card as she likes Peppa so that's cute and then she got me this little thing which is really cute I'm not sure if it's a dragon or a unicorn I'll ask her we're off to Ikea today in Lakeside and to the shopping centre as well so we should be going to the Disney shop which will be fun I need to get a couple of bits and also need to exchange something so I said the other day that Harvey had got me a few bits from Shop Disney for our anniversary so there was the princess sweater that I was wearing yesterday there's this Minnie Mouse shirt which is Minnie Mouse on here and then he also got me the new Minnie Mouse spirit jersey that they released just last week, which was a lovely surprise. But this is a small. And it's humongous. Now I know they are meant to come out quite big, but that is probably like way too big. Yeah, I'm gonna try and change it for an extra small if they have that in the shop, as I think that'll fit me a bit better. But yeah, I love it, it's really cute. They released a red one as well, which said Mickey Mouse on the back, so I might see if they've got that in store and show you guys. Happy Mother's Day. Oh, hey Paisley. Yeah. Where's Mummy's beautiful present? Is he a unicorn or a dragon? It has a horn. It does have a horn, so what could it be? A unicorn. It's a unicorn. What's his name? I don't know. Do you want to give him a name? Let me find him. You could just pick a name, baby. I want him to be Zoe. Zoe! That's cute. That's yeah. what Mickey Mouse's dragon's called, isn't it? Yeah. A little purple one. Oh. So this is my outfit for the day, as I said this is from the Disney store and it's Minnie Mouse, it says it on the collar here, and just jeans and then I've got my Danielle Nicole handbag as well with the big Mickey shape. Pezzy's kindly told me all morning that I look like a Dalmatian so that's fun. <laughs> can, I see, can I see your top? Who is it? Mickey Mouse. Yay, we're all Disneyed up today. Are you ready to go shopping? too bad today it's only about an hour away we've been singing nursery rhymes haven't we Paisley yeah what one's been your favorite oh, I, again. We, I don't know if I've actually said but we're looking for a new TV unit because ours at the minute is really low and you can see like the plug sockets that run along and then go up to the TV so we want a taller one that hides those plug sockets and fits all the Paisley's toys in. and fits some toys in as well so Pardon, darling? It's cold here, is it? Yeah. It's a pig, look. There it is. Perhaps we'll have a look afterwards, darling. We're we here at Ikea. <laughs> Paisley, what are you up to? What are you doing? 
Oh, you want some dinner? <laughs> I love these little setups. They're so cute. Oh, but I love it. Yeah. oh hello, Paisley. Hello. <laughs> Paisley's loving it. She thinks it's like a little playhouse. Come away from the toilet. Oh, no, it's not real, baby. <laughs> I think Paisley's had a turn in every bed within Ikea and she's got a new scrubbing brush that's her baby, apparently. You going to, you going to bed? Shut me up. I'm not going to shut you in there. <laughs> We're done in Ikea, just about got everything in the car <laughs> and got some sweets, didn't we baby girl? Yeah. Yeah, we managed to find a new TV unit, so that'll be fun putting that up this afternoon. Big <laughs> but it for should... me, not for Charlotte. Yeah, <laughs> me and Paisley will just go out. <laughs> but yeah, that should look nice and should make the living room look a bit nicer. So we're just heading over to Lakeside Shopping now to see what we can find and maybe get some lunch as well. You hungry, baby? Yeah. What shops do you want to go to? Donut shop. Yes, I want to get <laughs> a donut shop. <laughs> I mean that the afters. Oh, a donut shop for afters. Okay, baby. <laughs> we made it to the Disney shop. And Paisley was so good in IKEA. We said she can pick something as well. So we're Paisley shopping at Current. guys I don't know when the last time I picked up the camera was probably back in Lakeside but this is the TV unit that we bought from Ikea it's actually a sideboard but I think it goes really nicely here and I bought these pink flowers and the candles and the plant from Ikea as well and then just added a few pictures so there's me Harvey Paisley and Baymax in our Mickey frame and us in our Disney World frame as well. Yeah, really impressed. I think that looks really nice, especially compared to what we had before. I don't know if you'd have seen it in previous vlogs, but it was like a short TV stand that didn't cover the plugs or anything. And I love this. So we've just got home from work. It's uh, Monday evening. I've got a few jobs to do today. I want to get our flight seats booked for the Florida trip in October and I want to edit another vlog. Maybe the first Disneyland Paris one or maybe the next Walt Disney World one. I'll see how I feel later. But we're going to go out for a walk first with Paisley and Harvey's mum and Paisley's cousin. Aren't we darling? You okay? Yeah. How are you muff? Who are we going to walk with? Primrose. Primrose. So yeah, we're just waiting for them. It's a lovely evening. It's been so sunny today. The weather's really nice, but I do think it's going to start raining again tomorrow. But yeah, make the most of the weather while it's here. My face is in much better days than today, so excuse the state of me. Um, and I also still need to show you guys the stuff we bought from Shop Disney yesterday. So I will do that later on this evening. yummy dinner 
it was spaghetti and chicken and arrabbiata red sauce and then a ciabatta garlic bread really 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 nice a bit carb heavy probably but yummy nonetheless just gonna sit down and chill out i'm gonna watch a luca rich vlog on youtube we've got one of their weekly vlogs to catch up on um they put a picture up of rich doing a broccoli dance on instagram so i don't know why that's so intriguing but i really want to see what that's all about still in love with the tv unit by the way and i don't know if i mentioned we were getting a new rug as well circle rug not overly keen on it well we said we're not sure are we not too sure no. i think it looks good for the size at least it's a good size, but it's strange to have a circle rug. And then we've actually moved the other rug into the kitchen. And I don't know how I feel about kitchen... Well, that's the wrong light. That's better. I don't know how I feel about kitchen rug, but it looks okay. Need to straighten it up. We'll see. So, I've just sat down to show you guys the Disney store things that we bought yesterday when we went shopping in Lakeside. Um, I have got my washing machine on and my house is open plan, so sorry if that's loud. I'm hoping to do this before it starts to spin and get super, super loud, so we'll see. Right, so first up, as we went to watch Dumbo on Saturday, we bought this little Dumbo for Paisley and he's so cute with his big ears and his little circus hat on oh hi gran you like dumbo oh baby boy oh baby boy and the disney store had him on offer so you spend a certain amount and get him for i think it was like 10 pounds or 12 pounds or something but yeah really reasonable and he's very very cute next up i think i mentioned um on saturday that harvey had bought me the Minnie mouse spirit jersey and he bought it in a small and i was hoping to get it changed for an extra small um luckily they did have that in stock so i've got that and can't wait to wear it because it's so so cute harvey did get a hoodie though he got this one um i don't know if you can see there it says marvel and it's got marvel down the sides um red in the hood there and that was that was £28, so a bit more reasonable than the spirit jerseys, and he's looking forward to wearing that. Now, Paisley has some birthday money as well, so it was her birthday in early March. We let her choose a few bits and bobs, and she chose this little bag, which is the Disney Animators Collection, and it actually reverses inside out, so she can have two different patterns there, and then it's quite big on the inside. I don't know what a three-year-old will choose to put in her handbag but I'm sure we'll find out bless her and she's also recently started swimming lessons so she chose these Minnie Mouse goggles which are super cute now by the time this vlog goes live I probably would have already launched my Instagram giveaway for celebrating and um, reaching 5,000 followers so if you don't already follow me on Instagram come and check out my account it's at charlotte underscore in wonderland and there's lots of lots of fun disney photos on there from disney world disneyland paris and just disney life kind of thing so yeah these next few bits are for the giveaway so first of all we've got easter minnie mouse holding her little easter bunny there and she's super fluffy and cute so yeah love her also got these bath bombs for the giveaway there's three in there and they have marie on there they're from mad beauty as is this face mask and i've used these before myself they're lovely and then last of all i got this pen set so i think it's pixar themed so we've got monsters inc buzz nemo a bug's life randomly and ratatouille but yeah they're cool and i've got a couple more bits upstairs and some orders coming as well so it should be a nice little giveaway there which uh, hopefully lots of you will come and enter morning guys happy tuesday i am off to work and paisley's off to nursery school just thought i'd jump on and show you my outfit of the day so i've got this oh my disney snow white and poison apple jumper top thing just with some grey jeans and long boots it came with this little flyer which tells you what you can pair it up with that they also have in that range which I thought was pretty cool like the necklace there with the poison apple yeah Paisley's off to her school and she's actually going up a group today so she'll be in the bigger kids classroom are you excited no. 
Why not? You don't need to be scared, sweetheart. She has been excited. I'm sure she'll have a lot of fun. Who are you looking up? We've just got home from school and work and we're gonna play the shopping list game, myself and Paisley. She had a nice day in her new classroom. They said she got on really, really well. She did leave her teddy, her little sheep there though. So we've got to go back up to the nursery soon and grab that. But I think we're gonna pop to Sainsbury's anyway, aren't we, baby? How was your day at your new classroom? Not yet. Don't tell Fibby Wibbies. <laughs> <laughs> Should we play shopping lists? Yeah. Come on then. I bought this chocolate the other day when we were at Ikea. White chocolate and raspberries and it's super yummy. Not really a fan of white chocolate or chocolate with bits in, but this is actually really nice. I don't know why I picked it up. I think all the others were dark. So yeah, yum. This dog is so funny. He's literally sat guarding my snack cupboard because he's just seen me get the chocolate out. You're not having any, baby boy. You're not allowed chocolate. You're not allowed it, boy. You're so handsome. You are. Handsome man! Oh goodness! Oh no! So I've just sat down to edit the vlog tonight. I'm on Walt Disney World Day 12 Part 2, which is where we go to the Hollywood Brown Derby, and I think we met Tim Tracker in this one as well. So this will be fun to watch back. I've got all the essentials, I've got my hard drive here, it's plugged in with all the clips on my little glass of wine to keep me going, a monitor so I can see and hear Paisley, and all the camera bits and bobs here if I need them as well. So yeah, it usually takes about an hour to get a vlog edited and then I leave it to upload and sort itself out on YouTube, ready to be scheduled, so yeah. Morning, it's Wednesday, which is my day off. So me and Paisley are heading out for breakfast. New dumpling. Show me. Aww. So bouncy. And it's so cuddly. Oh, and sweetheart. It's, and he's so soft. And he can even wrap his arms around him. Wow, but can he fly? Yeah. Show me. Yeah. Dumbo. It was Dumbo. <laughs> I didn't know he was squeaky. Like a mouse. He was squeaking his dinner really, really good in my way. So I was squeaking as well. Oh, perfect. Come on then. We're back from breakfast. It's really nice. It's somewhere we go quite regularly because it's quite cool over there. They have the calf and they have a farm shop, a butchery and a wine shop festival. So yeah, just a few villages down the road. It's called the Baythorn Hall. I think that's, it's, it's Baythorn basically. And the calf's called Tarkas and it's very yummy. So we're just going to go into town and do some jobs, like go to the bank, aren't we? And get things on our shopping list. What's on your shopping list? It's a feather for Dumbo. A feather for Dumbo, that's beautiful. Anything else? 
And then you might play because your ones don't work. The mi oh, baby, we'll get your batteries for the microwave, yeah? And make it work. But I need a new pizza. Why? <laughs> You're not going to forget about that, are you? Why have you got your scrubber? Because I want to bring it with me. We can't take you out to the shops. <laughs> See you soon, Poppy. Love you. Oh. Popped back home again, we've done all the jobs and we're soon to go off swimming for Percy's swimming lesson. It's only her second ever one but last week it was really really fun so yeah, both looking forward to that. Come home to put the shopping away and to get our uh, swim stuff as well. So I'll show you what we got quickly, I've got quite a few it's in home bargains, nothing too interesting but I'll show you anyway. Okay, so first I got these diffuser things, apple and raspberry blush, they had a candle of the same flavour and that smelt super nice. What did we forget? Oh my goodness, we forgot Dumbo's feather! We'll have to go back! <laughs> so yeah, I thought I'd give these a whirl. They were only uh, $1.99 I think, so you can't really go too wrong. I got some Zaflora Linen Fresh as I put that in the mop water when I mop the floor downstairs and it makes it smell yummy down here. Got these treats for after swimming. For me and Paisley, she won't have a whole one, but I sure will. I'm eating terribly at the moment. I really need to start being a bit healthier. I got Paisley's toothpaste and my conditioner, which I haven't tried before, the IGX Tea Tree Mint one. Very green. And some hairspray. Everything's just a bit, oh, and paracetamol. Everything like this is a bit cheaper in home bargain, so I'll stock off on it while I'm in there. Finally got Paisley's batteries for her microwave, so we'll try and get that working when we come back. And I got her a reward chart pad as well, which I've been after for a while, and it just kind of jumped out at me. But it's got the weeks and the days of the weeks, and this week I will, so... Just will help with behaviour and that really. She's such a good little girl, but sometimes... So, it's way later now. I haven't filmed much this afternoon, as honestly, we haven't really done that much. Paisley had a swimming lesson, which was fun. And then we came home, she took a nap, I watched some Riverdale. And then we come home and we just walked the dog and things like that as well. So, yeah, quite a chilled afternoon, which was nice. It's about half past eight and I'm in bed already and have been for a while again watching Riverdale. I'm about halfway through season three now so I don't know what I'll do when it runs out because I've been watching it literally non-stop for the last few weeks but yeah I'm really enjoying that. Let me know in the comments below if you watch Riverdale as well. I think I've been quite late to the game but yeah I like it now. So this evening I sat and went through a huge bag like you know the massive massive shopping bags from Sainsbury's and Tesco's or wherever a great big one of those bags full of blu-rays and dvds that came out of the old tv unit because we don't even have a dvd pair anymore so I thought well I'll get rid of them thought I would try on music magpie as I remember doing that when I was like way 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 younger and making quite a bit of money from it but yeah I sat and scanned all these barcodes on the DVDs and got really excited to see the price and it came out at like 11 pounds and there must have been at least 50 60 films there so yeah I think I'm just gonna dispose of them to save the trouble of trying to sell them or whatever it was so ridiculous so some things like I think Taken was one of them came up for 5p I know it's an old film but it's quite a good film but you think you spend this money well, I suppose people don't really buy DVDs and Blu-rays and things anymore but you do spend this money on them and then they're just worth nothing which is a shame but hey ho Hi guys, it's Thursday and we've just got home from work and nursery. I've had quite a nice day actually, but I've no idea what's going on with the weather. It's so grey and miserable and really, really cold out there today actually as well, it's which raining, is... Mommy. It's been raining, baby. That's not good. Especially after all the sunshine we've had, that's a bit... Uh, disappointing but I suppose it's still spring so it's quite normal. I've had some parcels arrive today which I thought I would share with you guys. So first of all I've had some wax melts arrive from Practically Perfect Scents. 
who make wax melts and candles and car air fresheners as well and they do Disney um, park scents and Disney resort inspired and ride inspired scents so yeah they're an amazing company I love all of their products um, they kindly reached out when they were first starting up and sent me a couple of different scents which was so so kind and I've been a customer ever since so first of all I have the Main Street Bakery wax melts they come in this clamshell type packaging and there are six cubes in there this smells like warm cinnamon rolls and it's gorgeous when you walk into your house and it smells like this there's not a lot nicer than that next up we have the grand which is a scent that smells like the grand floridian resort and spa lobby and that is amazing as well it smells just like the resort And last of all, I ordered the Philhar Magical, which smells like the Philhar Magic attraction at Walt Disney World. And I think it said online it smells like um, baked apple pie. So yeah, that's yummy. And it's got those little Mickeys in as well. And they also kindly included these um, Sherbet Lemon wax melts as well. Um, lemon is actually one of my favourite scents, so that's amazing. Thank you so much, Practically Perfect Scents. So this one is a surprise which I'm going to show to Paisley. It's a unicorn outfit for Bren and I got that in the next sale for I think it was less than £5. I think he'll like that and she likes unicorns so that'll be fun. I'm going to go put it on him now. Do you want to be a unicorn? Do you like unicorns baby boy? Hello unicorn! <laughs> Paisley, a unicorn's coming! <laughs> Off he goes. I'm not sure he likes it. I'm glad I bought a large though, because it said the large was for Labradors and bigger dogs. But... Hi, unicorn! <laughs> Do you think he looks good, sweetheart? Yeah. Do you like unicorns? Look, can I give a treat to him? Yeah, you can get him a treat. Come with me. Unicorn, take that. Sit down, unicorn. I haven't got it. Sit down, unicorn. Oh, she threw it. The unicorn can't find his treat. Why? Because you threw it under the sofa. Well, guess get another one. Do you like unicorn food, baby boy? Woo! <laughs> yeah, that's my excitement for today. Can't wait to get the wax melts on later because they literally fill up the whole room and smell so good. I'll link them down below. Yeah, the wax milk, they really are so, so lovely. We are heading over to the pub across the road for some dinner. And my... Nanny gonna come? Yeah, Nanny's gonna come. Let's go, baby. From the pub where we went for a quick bite to eat i just had some chips and a little bit of garlic bread and Percy told me she wanted to go to the pub last night so yeah we just went there for tea it's only across the road come back and i've done the hoovering and some mopping and i have some drying in the machine and i just cleaned the bathroom quickly paisley is asleep and that's about as fun as our evening is going to get i've got the sherbet lemon wax melt burning at the moment and um, when it all melts down, you can see the glitter start to disperse. It smells lovely. It smells literally just like the sweet sherbet lemon. So that's perfect. Bren's chilling out and he's happy that he's no longer a unicorn. Though you did look very handsome, baby boy. You look like a beautiful unicorn, didn't you? And I'm fully aware of how much I've spoken about the TV unit this week, but I am in love with it. Do you ever have something that just brings you so much happiness? It's such a small change in this room, but literally it's made it feel completely different. And we've got this new lamp as well, as the other one had, um, you had to turn it off at the actual plug, which was right down here and really quite difficult to get to. So yeah, this one, you just like tap it and it, oh, 
darkness. You suppose, oh there we go. Tap it and it gets brighter. I think it's got a couple of different settings, but yeah. I think that looks quite pretty on there. And it's made the world of difference not having the toys out. So before all the toys were stored around the TV unit, but now they're all safely away in the cupboard. Stand up, Bryder. There he is. Got the Muppet Babies under there. Happy days. Earlier on in the week that I needed to log in to our flight details on the BA website and book our seats for our Florida trip in October. So I've just sat down to do that now. Okay, so this grey line at the top here is the front of the economy section and the blacked out ones here are where the pull down bits come down for the cots so you see these pictures of the babies there which is where we used to sit and i think they're actually reserved for people traveling with infants and this here is where we like to sit so you are kind of the exit doors are here um so you're like the sixth off of the plane not far at all and if you've been to orlando airport before you know exactly what the deal is there so you kind of want to be off that plane ASAP because you could end up sitting way, 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 way back here and then you're already going to be in the most humongous line because it's all of these people in front. I also like this front cabin because it's smaller. So the front cabin in economy ends here and then there's the bathrooms and kind of a little break area. So it splits up the massive area and then the smaller area and it feels slightly more... Um, compact I don't know if that's the right word it just feels I'm an anxious flyer so I like to know that things are the way I like them to be in advance morning guys it's finally Friday the last day at work before a lovely weekend the skies look a bit bluer out there today so hopefully not quite so cold rainy and gross I am ready for work in my Mickey Mouse Primark jumper and Paisley's just woken up in her Minnie Mouse Christmas jammies. Good morning. Mm. Good morning. <laughs> you feeling shy? Yeah. <laughs> what are you going to have for breakfast? Eggs. Eggs? But strawberries? And strawberries. Remember we went and got those strawberries, didn't we? Yeah. So yeah, just sitting here for a few minutes, chilling out, letting Paisley come round because she's only just woken up. Friends here too. Good morning, Papalapalus. Are you okay? Yes, I am. When I didn't wear your jumper to bed. He can wear his jumper in a little while if he wants, darling. Thank Do you want to be the unicorn again? Yes, please. He says he does. Okay, finish. But put our straps on it. It does have straps on it, yeah. That will make you sad. Why? Because it has a, a, a scratchy bit. It doesn't have a scratchy bit. That's where it does up, darling. He'll be okay. Yeah, See, he sure. said yes. The other day, I showed you these uh, reed diffusers that I'd got from Home Bargains and said how you couldn't really go wrong as they were only one ninety nine each. No. The fact that they smell of absolutely nothing means you can go wrong with a diffuser. <laughs> so I wouldn't bother with those. When I was laying here this morning, I was looking at my purple potion mini ears over here and thinking about where to put them up on the ear display as there's nowhere really obvious for them to go as it's kind of like going round now in the loop. Um, I wonder whether to start a new section kind of over here and start with from the bottom one two three four five more pairs going up or over this five, side six, five, or whether I put them up five, the top there but there's not room for a whole row. Yeah. That's my Friday morning dilemma. Um, I would like to get them up though because I've had them a while now. Now I think we might end this weekly vlog here as it's Friday as I said and I don't think we're doing anything at all this evening so there'll be nothing to film. Um, I hope you've enjoyed the weekly vlog. I don't know if it'll be too exciting as we haven't done a huge amount of things. And, and I was 
sharing this. You was on it, yeah, so that makes it extra special, doesn't it? But yeah, it's just our day to day lives really. Um, as I said at the start, it's a way for me to practice filming mm. and editing in between Disney trips. And hopefully somebody enjoys it. If you did, then please give this video a big thumbs up as it does help my channel out a lot. Can you do thumbs up? And subscribe for more family fun and Disney adventures.